Good evening, ladies and gentlemen, and welcome to John Harden High School for tonight's 17th District Volleyball Championship game. Tonight's matchup has the Elizabethtown Panthers and the Central Harden Bruins squaring off. We're now going to turn it over to our PA announcer for tonight's lineups. For Central Harden, coming in 32 and 5 on the season, while the Elizabethtown Panthers under Coach Bart Catlett come in 26 and 10 on the year. These two teams met twice during the year. Central Harden winning in both of those. They won three sets to one in the first matchup at Elizabethtown, and then a few weeks after that, they won 3-0 at home over the Panthers. And a reminder, both of these teams move on to next week's region tournament that will be held at Greene County High School. Uh, if either of the teams makes it to the semifinals or the finals, we will have that for you here on HCC TV. We will try to send that live through NFHS. Uh, we will not be able to send it through Brandenburg, but we will tape it. It will be on our YouTube channel as soon as we can get it out. Central Harden comes in as the number one seed. They advance here after a straight sets victory over John Harden last night. Elizabethtown came into the tournament the number three seed as they defeated North Harden last night in straight sets. These are the same two teams that met last year for the district championship and then later the region championship. Central Harden winning both of those. On the court for Elizabethtown, it'll be Jessica Smallwood, Addison Janes, Macy Singleton, Grace Godfrey, Alyssa Philpott, and Brooke Snyder with Lexi Davis coming in as the Libero. For Central Harden, it'll be Sadie Atcher, Katie Vest, Larkin Taylor, Gracie Blair, Claire Worrell, Jordan Fortner with Sam Nelson coming in as the Libero. And Central Harden will have first serve tonight. 
Again, it is a best three out of five sets. Each set goes to 25, must be leading by two. Must we get to a fifth set, which it'll go to 15, leading by two. Sam Nelson will start us off with the serve. Godfrey up to James right at the net. Singleton sends it over, gets the kill. Point E-Town. Addison James will head to the service line as McKenna Brown checks in on the front line for E-Town. One serving zero. Catches the tape. Blair to Vest outside at your back line. It's long. Two serving zero. Ace as that one catches the back line. Three serving zero. That one travels long. Point Central and Sadie Atcher will now come to the line. One serving three. Davis to Godfrey. Now it'll be bumped over by Janes. Blair to Vest. Outside, Warrell just will tap that one over. Janes gets it with one hand. Davis bump sets for Smallwood. That one comes off the side of her hand. Point central. Two serving three. Davis to Janes, back row. Godfrey will send this one over. Nelson to Vest. Outside Warrell, big swing. That one returned by Davis and she'll get the point. Alyssa Philpott will check in on the front line for the Panthers as Lexi Davis heads to the service line for serving two. Atcher to Vest, she sends it over. James gets to that one. Davis will pop it up. Now Brown will send it back row. Blair to Vest, across for Warrell. And that goes off the blockers, point central. Kate Disselkamp will check in on the front line for Central as Katie Vest heads to the service line. Three serving four. You tell Faithful not thinking that one cleared the tape. Davis returns it. Well, now Taylor and Nelson will send it back row. Godfrey is there to Janes outside for Smallwood. She winds up. Nelson digs that one. Vest outside. Where else? She'll go off speed. Smallwood to James. McKenna Brown tips it over and gets the kill. Ella Brown now checking in on the front line for the Panthers as Jessica Smallwood heads to the service line. Five serving three. On the scoreboard, Central Harden is the home team. Nelson to Vest for Taylor inside and she gets the kill. Jordan Fortner will check in on the front line for Central Harden as Addison Sego checks in to the serve for serving five. Davis, not gonna get to an ace for Sego. Five serving five. Long, Queen E Town. Brooke Snyder will check back in for the Panthers. I'll see him. Nelson will check back in for the Bruins. 
Snyder to serve, six serving five. Ace, seven serving five. Ace, eight serving five. Nelson overpass. Phil Pot takes it. She gets the kill. Nine serving five. Four consecutive points now by the Panthers. Atcher to Vest. Outside Worrell. She winds up. And off a couple of Panthers. And or else we'll get the kill. And Claire Whirl now to serve for Central Harden. Six serving nine. Smallwood. To Davis, who upsets Ella Brown will roll this from the back line. Worrell will just be able to get to it best across for Atcher. She winds up down the middle. It's long. Central thinking there was a touch on the E-Town side. Point E-Town. Macy Singleton back in on the front line as Alyssa Philpott heads to the service line. Ten serving six. Nelson will get to that one. Now Vest will bump it over. Snyder to Janes in the middle. Singleton, that one. Vest diving, get to Fortner. Sends it back over and gets the point for the Bruins. But Davis back in on the back line for the Panthers. As Gracie Blair checks in and heads to the service line. Katie Commonson also in on the back line for Central Harden. Seven, serving ten. Snyder to Janes, outside Ella Brown. That one goes, she tools the block and gets the kill. Grace Godfrey will check back in for Elizabethtown. 11, serving seven. Blair to Vest. I'm just going to clear the net. Joust at the net. Won by the Panthers. 12 serving seven. Surprise Coach Reinecker hasn't called a timeout yet. Blair to Vest. Atcher now, that one blocked at the net by Janes. Vest bump sets it back for Atcher again, off speed. Godfrey gets to it on the back row. Davis outside, now Small will send it to the back. Commonson to Vest, he'll just dump it over. Snyder gets to that, Janes outside for Smallwood, back line gets the kill. And now Coach Reinecker will take a timeout as E-Town goes up six, 13 to seven. This is a Hardin County Educational and Community Television student production. HCCTV is a division of Hardin County Schools. Live Channel 1 programming sponsored in part by Brandenburg Telecom, providing service for all your telecommunication needs. Physical Therapy Associates, more personal attention for more effective results. eTownSelfStorage.com, finally a place conveniently located in Elizabethtown for more than just your self-storage needs. Waddell's Auto and Scrap Metal Recycling, a family-owned business with competitive prices, pickup service, and a friendly staff. Etown Exterminating is a locally owned, family-run pest control company 
that has been serving the surrounding areas of Kentucky since 1976, and West Point Bank. Let us help make life simpler. Hometown baking made simple. As we come back out, it'll be great. Sorry, Grace Godfrey at the line for Elizabethtown. 13, serving seven. That one sails long. Service area, point over two. The Bruins, Larkin Taylor back in on the front line. First central artist, Sam Nelson to the service line. Eight serving 13. That one overpass. Atcher to Vest to Taylor in the middle. Smallwood gets to it. Jane will pop it back up. Now Smallwood sends it back row. Commons is there to Vest. Outside, Atcher winds it up again and gets the kill. Nine serving 13. Godfrey to Janes outside Smallwood. Killed by Jessica Smallwood. Point Panthers. McKenna Brown back in on the front line as Addison Janes heads to the service line. 14, serving nine. That one, service error, point back to the Bruins. Claire Worrell now will check in on the front line. Sadie Atcher to serve, 10 serving 14. Godfrey, overpass. Tip kill that time by Taylor. Oh, there's going to be a net violation on the Bruins. Point for Elizabethtown. That'll get Alyssa Philpot back in on the front line as Lexi Davis hits to the service line. 15, serving 10. Nelson to Vest. Outside Warrell. She'll go across court. Davis gets that one. James pops it up. Smallwood rolls it back line. Nelson to Vest. Outside again, Morell back line. That's long. Point E Town. 16 serving 10. Atcher to Vest. Outside Morell. That one dug out by Godfrey. Jane's outside Smallwood back line. Atcher gets to that one. Best pumps it and then Royal just taps it over. Davis sends it back and a tip kill that time from Claire Worrell. Hey, Disselkamp now will check in on the front line for the Bruins. Katie Vest heads to the service line. 11 serving 16. Davis to James. McKenna Brown, that one goes off the antenna, so it's out, point central. 12 serving 14. Sorry, 12 serving 16. Davis, back to that, James. Phil Pot, as Atcher gets to it. And Vest not able to get that one back in. Point E-Town. Ella Brown back in on the front line as Jessica Smallwood heads to the service line. 17 serving 12. That one service error. Jordan Fortner now checks in on the front line while Addison Seago checks in on the back line for the Bruins. Seago to serve, 13, serving 17. Davis 
to Janes for Philpot. Blocked to the net by Worrell. That'll be a double and a point for the Bruins. 14 serving 17. Davis to James. McKinnon Brown gets it over. Vest gets to that one. For, or sorry, this one camp. And now Atro just roll it back wide. James to Davis outside. Ella Brown cuts across. Seago gets that one to Vest. This one's going to be tight to the net. Joust at the net. And now Fortner. So ball considered out off the block. So point to Central Harden. 15 serving 17. Smallwood to James, dumps it over. Best gets to that one. Seago Bunk sets outside. Worrell off the front line. James to Davis. Now Ella Brown will send it into the net. Gets the kill. And it just got over the tape and off front line player for the Bruins. Brooke Snyder back in for E-Town. Larkin Taylor back in for Central Harden. Catches the net, doesn't clear. Ecom's had several service errors tonight. Claire Worrell now heads to the service line for Central Harden, 16 serving 18. That one sails long. Central gives the point right back to the Panthers. AC Singleton will check in on the front line as Alyssa Philpot heads to the service line. And Katie Commons and checking in on the back row for the Bruins. Commons in to Vest in the middle for Fortner. Fortner pulls the block. Point Bruins. Lexi Davis back in on the back line for the Panthers. And it'll be Gracie Blair checking in for the Bruins. She'll head to the service line. 17 serving 19. Snyder to Janes, back row Smallwood. Nelson digs that one, Vest outside for Atcher off the front line. Davis gets to that one, Janes will dump it over. Gotten there by, oh sorry, Blair. Now Janes back row for Smallwood, another dig. This one kind of come back over the net. But Joust hit the net, pop back over. Vest sends it back, and the Bruins get the point. And with that, Coach Catlett. Oh, he made a motion like he wanted a timeout. And he will get the timeout. As the Central Harden faithful come to their feet. Tune in weekly for all local HDEC TV programs, airing on Brandenburg Telecom and Comcast Cable Channel 2. Spectrum Communications Channel 184. You can always check out our past broadcast on our YouTube channel. Just search HCEC TV. Subscribe to our channel. Get all your local community sports and events. We'd also like to thank NFHS, the National Federation of High School Sports, and its support in providing live streaming service. Contact NFHS.com to subscribe today. Friday night, we're back on the air. We'll be at Central Harden for football action as the Barron County Trojans come to take on the Central Harden Bruins. That one with an 8 o'clock kickoff. It will be homecoming for Central Harden. Coach Paul Gray and Jeff Knoll will bring you all of the action. Next week, if either Elizabethtown or Central Harden makes it to the semifinals at the region tournament, we will have that. And if either of them make it to the finals, we'll have that as well. Snyder to Janes in the middle. Singleton, she gets the kill. 
Grace Godfrey will check back in for Elizabeth Town. She heads to the service line. 20, serving 18. Commons in to Nelson. Atcher rolls it back line. Davis there for James. Sets outside. Smallwood comes across. Atcher sends it back. Davis pops it up. James sets it back outside. Smallwood again. That one's long. Point Bruins. Sam Nelson now to the line for Central Harden as Larkin Taylor checks back in on the front line. 19 serving 20. Godfrey to Davis. Small little roll at back line. Blair to Vest. Cross for Taylor just tapped over. Smallwood gets it. James gives it right back for Smallwood. And that one's wide. And we are tied at 20 apiece. We were tied at five. E-Town worked it to a six-point lead at 16 to 10. And since then, Central has squared it back up. 20 apiece. We are in set number one. Davis to James in the middle. Singleton tapped over, popped up in the air by Atcher. Vest sends it back outside. Atcher one time off the blocker. James will dump that one over. Nelson gets to it. Now Vest for Atcher to the middle, dug out by Smallwood. Uh, Singleton comes up. She gets the kill. Point E-Town. McKenna Brown back in for E-Town. We're on the front line as Addison James heads to the service line. Commonson overpass. Tried to get it with Smallwood. Back outside. Atcher blocked in the net. Nelson pops that one up to Vest. She'll go back outside for Atcher. Back row. Godfrey gets that dig. James across for Smallwood, and it's another kill for Justice Smallwood. 22 serving 20. And Central Harden will take their second timeout of set number one. This is a Harden County Educational Community Television student production. HCC TV is a division of Harden County Schools. Live Channel One programming sponsored in part by Brandenburg Telecom, Physical Therapy Associates, eTownSelfStorage.com, Waddell's Auto and Scrap Metal Recycling, eTown Exterminating, and West Point Bank. Set number one against first one to 25, leading by two. Addison Jane's at the line for the Panthers. 22 serving 20. Nelson to Vest. Outside Atcher. She gets the kill as she goes down the line. Claire Worrell back in on the front line for the Bruins. As Sadie Atcher heads to the service line. 21 serving 22. Ace. A little miscommunication that time by the Panthers. We're tied at 22 apiece. The ball headed down the tunnel. Twenty-two all. Godfrey to James. This one's gonna be tight to the net. Blocked over. Best pops it up. Nelson will set it outside. Worrell down the line. It's long. Point E Town. 
Alyssa Philpont back in on the front line as Brooke Davis hits to the service line. 23 serving 22. Hatcher to Vest, outside Worrell, blocked at the net, sent back. Somehow Worrell gets it over. Davis bump sets for Smallwood. She winds up, Hatcher gets that one into the rafters. Nelson gets to it, but not able to play it. And E-Town will serve for the set. 24 serving 22. You can play the ball out of the rafters on your side of the net. That one sails long. Katie Vest will head to the line for the Bruins. Jordan, or sorry, Kate Disselkamp checking back in on the front line for the Bruins. Davis to James. Smallwood down the line. Nelson gets that one. Vest outside. Worrell, she hits to the kill to the middle. And they're all tied at 24 apiece. Davis to James, outside Smallwood, slides up, gets the kill. And Newtown will have set point again as Ella Brown will check in on the front line. Jessica Smallwood heads to the service line. 25, serving 24. And an ace from Smallwood will do it. E-Town takes set number one, 26-24. This is a Hardin County Education and Community Television student production. HCC TV is a division of Hardin County Schools. Live Channel 1 programming sponsored in part by Brandenburg Telecom, providing service for all your telecommunication needs. Featuring Mark, protect what matters most. Stream, watch TV from your BBTEL app. BBTEL Secure, a safer home awaits. BBTEL Blast, make the most of your Wi-Fi. Go online for more information at BBTEL.com. Physical Therapy Associates, more personal attention for more effective results. With locations in Elizabethtown, Hodgenville, Radcliffe, Bardstown, Brandenburg, and South Louisville. Or go online at PhysicalTherapyKY.com. E-TownSelfStorage.com, finally a place conveniently located in Elizabethtown for more than just your self-storage needs. Featuring video surveillance, climate-controlled self-storage, but also storage for RVs and boats with electrical outlets in every spot to keep everything charged up and ready to go when you are. Go to E-TownSelfStorage.com for more information. Waddell's Auto and Scrap Metal Recycling, a family-owned business with competitive prices, pickup service, and a friendly staff available for all of your recycling needs. Located off Interstate 65, exit 91, at 311 Steel Drive in Elizabethtown, call 270-982-7206 to talk to someone about scrapping metal and recycling. E-Town Exterminating is a locally owned family-run pest control company that has been serving Hardin, Meade, Grayson, and Nelson counties in the surrounding areas of Kentucky since 1976. Whatever your pest control issues are, termites, spiders, crickets, general pests, even moles, their team has the knowledge, skill, and training to safely and effectively eliminate the problem. Call 270-737-6900 or go online at mugabug.com. And West Point Bank, hometown banking made simple. The five offices in Elizabethtown, Radcliffe, Upton, Glendale, and West Point. Let us help make life simpler. Hometown banking made simple online at westpointbank.com.
as the teams start to head back out onto the court. For the Bruins, it'll be Katie Vest, Sadie Atcher, Larkin Taylor, Gracie Blair, Katie Commonson, Jordan Fortner, and Sam Nelson will check in as the Libero. For E-Town, as they come out, it will be Alyssa Philpott, Macy Singleton, Addison James, Jessica Smallwood, Grace Godfrey, Brooks Snyder, and Lexi Davis will check in as the Libero. Everybody ready. E-Town will have first serve in the second set. Grace Godfrey to start us off. Blair to Vest for Atcher. Off the front line, Katie Atcher gets the kill. Sam Nelson heads to the service line for Central. Addison Seago is going to check in. Fortner will check in on the front line. One serving zero. Davis to James. Across for Smallwood. She'll roll it to the middle. Atcher gets that one to Vest. Back for Atcher. Just taps it over. Snyder gets it over, but it goes wide. Point Bruin. Two serving zero. Ace. Three serving zero. Godfrey to James across for Smallwood. That one doesn't clear the tape. Four serving zero. Snyder to James for Singleton. Dug out by Commons and on the back row. Atcher gets it over. I thought that was outside the antenna. Cross. Smallwood, no doubt in that one, and she gets the kill. Larkin Taylor check back in. Actually, it'll be, end up being Sam Nelson as the lead row checks back in. McKenna Brown back in for the Panthers as Addison James hits to the service line. One serving four. Blair to Vest in the middle. Fortner blocked that. They said they clear the tape. Point Panthers. Two serving four. Blair to Vest outside Atcher. And that one didn't clear the tape either. Four hits. Three serving four. Combinson to Vest across. Another one into the net after reeling off four straight points. Through the Bruins, the Panthers come right back and reel off four in a row of their own. Four serving four.
Robinson to Nelson. For Atcher, she'll roll it back the line. Godfrey there to James. Outside, Smallwood. Back row, Nelson gets to that one. Bumped across by Atcher. Now Vesta send it back row. James gets to it to Brown. And Singleton sends it over. Blair to Vest. Outside, Atcher, back row. It's long. Point E town. Dig by Vest, or sorry, dig by Nelson to Vest. Fortner gets the left-handed kill. Claire Morell will check back in as Sadie Atcher heads to the service line. Five, serving five. Davis to James outside Smallwood. That goes off the front line and in. Another kill for Jessica Smallwood. Alyssa Philpot back in on the front line for the Panthers. As Brooke Davis will head to the service line. Six, serving five. Hatcher to Vest, outside Worrell. Popped up by, I'm going to say a lift by the Panthers. Point Central. Kate Disselkamp now checking into the lineup for the Bruins as Katie Vest heads to the service line. Six, serving six. We are in set number two. Elizabethtown took set number one, 26-24. Davis from Godfrey, and now Smallwood sends it over. Atcher to Vest, no one home. Point, E-Town. Ella Brown back in on the front line. It's Jessica Smallwood heads to serve, seven serving six. Up, Atcher to Nelson, back to Atcher. She'll send it back row. Davis is there for James. Phil Pot. Phil Pot finds an open hole. Eight serving six. Pass. Best gets to it, popped it up. Uh, yep. Nine serving six. Worrell to Vest. Back for Worrell. Stop the net. Phil Pot pops it back up. Bouncing around, Davis pops it in the air. Ella Brown sends it over. Nelson to Vest, back sets for Disselkamp. She goes back line, gets the kill. Sam Nelson now to serve for Central Harden. Seven serving nine. Ace. Ace, eight serving nine. That one goes long. Point E town. Brooke Snyder will check in and head to the service line for Panthers. Ten serving eight. Nelson to Vest. 
Outside for Taylor. They have a net violation on Taylor Point E-Town. 11 serving eight. Nelson to Vest. For Warrell, she'll send it across. Snyder to Janes, back row, Smallwood. That one's wide, point central. Claire Warrell now to the service line. Nine serving 11. Snyder to Janes, outside Ella Brown, off the front line gets the kill. Katie Collinson will check in on the back line for Central Harden as Macy Singleton checks in on the front line for the Panthers and Alyssa Philpot will head back to serve. 12 serving nine. Collinson to Vest in the middle for a double on Vest. Point E-Town. Even some E-Town fans didn't think it was a double. 13 serving nine. Commons an overpass, tip back over by James. He gets the tip kill. And Central Harden will take their first time out of set number two. This is a Hardin County Educational Community Television student production. HCC TV is a division of Hardin County Schools. Live streaming channel one programming sponsored in part by Brandenburg Telecom, providing service for all your telecommunication needs. Physical therapy associates, more personal attention for more effective results. E-TownSelfStorage.com, finally a place in E-Town for more than just your self-storage needs. Waddell's Auto and Scrap Metal Recycling, a family-owned business with competitive prices, pickup service, and a friendly staff available for all your recycling needs. E-Town Exterminating is a locally-owned family-run pest control company that's been serving the surrounding areas of Kentucky since 1976. In West Point Bank, let us help make life simpler. Hometown banking made simple. As we come back out, it'll be Alyssa Philpot at the line for Elizabethtown. 14 serving nine. Commons in to Vest outside at your block to the net. Nelson to Vest in the middle now for Taylor and she pulls the block. Bruins get a point. Lexi Davis back in for Elizabethtown on the back line. Gracie Blair will head to the service line for the Bruins. 10 serving 14. Snyder to Janes, middle Smallwood rolls it over. Atcher gets to that one, Vest. Quick set inside for Taylor. Smallwood gets to that one, Janes. Quick set for Singleton. Commonson will pick up that one. Vest for Atcher, back line, nose off Davis. Smallwood outside, Ella Brown. She tools the block, point in town. Grace Godfrey back in for Elizabethtown. 15 serving 10. Commonson to Vest outside after right down the line. She gets the kill. Addison Sego heads to the service line for the Bruins. Jordan Fortner checks in on the front line. 11 serving 15. That one sails long. Point Panthers. 
Sam Nelson will check back in on the back line for the Bruins as McKenna Brown heads to the front line for the Panthers as Addison James now to serve. 16 serving 11. Commons in. That'll be an ace. 17 serving 11. Layer back set by, ooh, sorry, now McKenna Brown sends it over. Vest for Atcher, blocked to that, into the net, and not going to be got back over. Point, E-Town. Eighteen serving eleven. Sales long. Claire World now to check back in on the front line for Central Harden. As Sadie Atcher heads to the service line. 12 serving 18. Davis to Godfrey. McKenna Brown send it back row. Atcher to Vest. Outside, Worrell. She gets the kill. Thirteen serving eighteen. Davis to James outside Smallwood. She gets the kill. Lisa Philpot checking back in on the front line as Lexi Davis now to serve. Nineteen serving thirteen. Hatcher to Vest. Now Nelson will just bump it over and gets the kill. It goes just beyond the reach of McKenna Brown and the dive from Grace Godfrey. Hey, this who can't back in on the front line for the Bruins as Katie Vest now to serve. 14 serving 19. Davis to James for Smallwood. Tipped over, blocked to the net. Now Smallwood takes another one. Vest outside where else she'll tip it, go down the line. Godfrey pops that one up. Jane sets it up for McKenna Brad. She gets the kill. 20 serving 14. And Ella Brown checks back in on the front line as Jessica Smallwood heads to the service line. For Central, Jordan Fortner checks back in. Worrell to Vest, back outside for Worrell. Knocked at the net, Janes to Davis. Now McKenna Brown, dug out by Nelson to Vest. Back outside Worrell, that one blocked in the net. Nelson pops it up, Vest sets it right back for Worrell. She tools the block and gets the kill. Larkin Taylor back in on the front line for Central. Sam Nelson hits to the service line. 15 serving 20. Service there, point Panthers. Mark Snyder back in for the Panthers as she'll head to the service line. 21 serving 15. Nelson to Vest. Outside Taylor. And Taylor gets it in on the back line. Now Claire Worrell heads to the service line for the Bruins. 
16 serving 21. Smallwood to James for Phil Pot. Worrell digs it, it, sends it back over Ella Brown. Now to be Phil Pot again, and she goes off the blockers and gets the kill. Katie Commons and checking back in for Central Harden. Macy Singleton back in on the front line for E Town as Alyssa Philpot will serve. 22 serving 16. Best in the middle for Taylor. She gets back to back kills. Lexi Davis back in for the Panthers as Gracie Blair checks back in for Central. She'll head to the service line. 17, Serene 22. Davis, Snyder, and James will roll it over. Nelson to Vest. And Atcher just runs up to send it back line. Smallwood to James in the middle. Singleton, that doesn't clear the net. Point Bruins. 18 serving 22. Davis right to the net. James unable to get to an ace for Blair. 19 serving 22. Timeout, E Town. This is an HEC TV production. We are a division of Hardin County Schools. Tune in weekly for all local HCC TV programs airing on Brandenburg Telecom and Comcast Cable Channel 2, Spectrum Communications Channel 184. You can always check out our past broadcasts on our YouTube channel. Just search HCC TV, subscribe to our channel, and get all your local community sports and events. I'd like to thank all of our student workers tonight. We have Tayshawn Jackson and Ethan Gross on cameras. Our audio is Jack Settle, technical director who was also our camera person last night, Lorraine Sullivan, all under the direction of Mr. Jeremy Miller. We come back out of the timeout. Gracie Blair will be at the line for the Bruins, 19 serving 22. Multiple times here in this second set, Elizabethtown has had a six point lead. That lead now to three. Snyder. And James just drops that one over. Sent back by Blair. Now James back row for Smallwoods. Nelson gets to it. Vest bump sets for Atra. She'll roll it in there. Davis gets to that one. James, she'll send it outside. Ella Brown goes back center and gets the kill. As Grace Godfrey checks in for Etel. She'll head to the service line. 23 serving 19. Commons in to Vest. Cross for Atcher. Rolls it there. Snyder gets to it. James sends it back now. Smallwood will send it over. Blair to Vest for Taylor. Dug out by Snyder to James. Outside Smallwood. Atcher sends it back. Smallwood sends it right back. And E-Town will serve for set number two. Twenty-four serving nineteen. Commons in to Blair. Taylor will bump it over. Snyder to James outside Smallwood. She'll send it back row. Nelson gets that one to Vest. This one's going to clear the net. Taylor knocks it up. Nelson back for Atcher. She throws the block and gets the kill. Jordan Fortner back in on the front line as Addison Sego heads to the service line. 20, serving 24.
Davis to James, dumped over. Fortner will pop it right back. Singleton tips over. Atcher gets that one. Joust to the net. Sent back over by Blair, and then Smallwood back. Commonson gets it. Tim back over, and E-Town takes set number two on the Jessica Smallwood kill. And E-Town goes up 2-0. As we get ready for the third set. This is a Hardin County Educational Community Television student production. HCEC TV is a division of Hardin County Schools. Live Channel 1 programming sponsored in part by Brandenburg Telecom, providing service for all your telecommunication needs. Featuring Bark, protect what matters most. BBTEL stream, watch TV with your BBTEL app. BBTEL secure, a safer home awaits. BBTEL blast, make the most of your Wi-Fi. Visit BBTEL.com today. Physical Therapy Associates, more personal attention for more effective results. With locations in Elizabethtown, Hodgenville, Radcliffe, Bardstown, Brandenburg, and South Louisville, or go online at physicaltherapyky.com. Etownselfstorage.com, finally a place conveniently located in Elizabethtown for more than just your self-storage needs. Featuring video surveillance, climate-controlled self-storage, but also storage for RVs and boats with electrical outlets in every spot to keep everything charged up and ready to go when you are. Go to etownselfstorage.com today for more information. Waddell's Auto and Scrap Metal Recycling, a family-owned business with competitive prices, pickup service, and a friendly staff available for all your recycling needs. Located off Interstate 65 at exit 91 on 311 Steel Drive, call 270-982-7206 to talk to someone about scrapping metal and recycling. E-Town Exterminating is a locally owned family-run pest control company that's been serving Hardin, Meade, Grayson, and Nelson counties in the surrounding areas of Kentucky since 1976. Whatever your pest control issues are, termites, spiders, crickets, gentle pests, even moles, their team has the knowledge and skill and training to safely and effectively eliminate the problem. Call 270-737-6900 or go online at mugabug.com. West Point Bank, hometown banking made simple with five offices located at Elizabethtown, Radcliffe, Upton, Glendale, and West Point. West Point Bank, working better together online at westpointbank.com. Get ready for set number three. Central Harden sends out Larkin Taylor, Gracie Blair, Sadie Atcher, Jordan Fortner, Claire Worrell. Katie Vest will also step out there, and Sam Nelson will be the libero. For Elizabethtown, Jessica Smallwood, Alyssa Philpott, Grace Godfrey, Macy Singleton, Brooke Snyder, Addison James, and the libero is Brooke Davis. Central Harden will have first serve here in set number three. Godfrey to Davis. Smallwood now will bump this one back row. Nelson to Vest. Outside, Atcher, she gets the kill. One serving zero. Goes wide service error point E Town. Addison James will head to the service line. So McKenna Brown will check back in on the front line for the Panthers. One serving one.
Dug out at the net vest for Taylor. That goes long, Point town Two, serving one. Blair to Vest for Atcher. She goes across court. It catches the line. Point central. And Sadie Atcher will head to the service lot. Two serving two. Davis to James. Outside Smallwood. Nelson gets it, sends it back over. Davis is there. James right at the net for Singleton. That one blocked. Point central. Three serving two. Godfrey to James. Outside Smallwood again. She gets the kill. Melissa Philpot back in on the front line as Lexi Davis hits to serve. Three, serving three. Atcher to Vest for Worrell. She goes back row. Godfrey got that one. Now to James outside Smallwood. It's good, right down the middle. Four, serving three. Nelson to Vest for Taylor. She gets the kill. Kate Disselkamp back in on the front line for the Bruins. Katie Vest heads to the service line. Four serving four. Godfrey to Janes. Now Smallwood to roll it back line. Nelson to Vest. Across for Taylor. Taylor gets the kill. Five serving four. Catch to the top of the tape, and I'll be an ace for Vest. Six serving four. Davis to James. Smallwood down the center. Nelson gets that one to Vest. Outside, Worrell just going to tap that one over. Smallwood to Janes. Back for Smallwood, and she gets the kill. She went right over top of Melissa Philpot to get that one. Ella Brown will check back in as Jessica Smallwood will head to the service line. Five serving six. Worrell to Nelson. She'll send it over. Philpot sends it back. That's going to be a lift and a point for the Panthers. Six, serving six. That'll be an ace. Seven, serving six. A 
Look at that. Taylor to Vest for Warrell off the top. Smallwood gets that one to Jane. She'll dump it over. Vest pumps it up. Now Nelson bump sets for Warrell. Down the line. It's wide. Point E Town. Eight serving six. Atcher to Vest for Worrell. Blocked at the net. Atcher gets it. Vest will send it back. Corner Davis to Janes. Outside. Ella Brown going to roll this one. Addis, or sorry, Atcher to Vest. Blocked at the net from Taylor. And dumped over. Now Davis gets that one. Janes back row for Smallwood. And she tools the block and gets. Oh, doesn't tool the block. Goes out off of the net. Point Central. Jordan Fortner back in on the front line as Addison Sego heads to the service line. Seven serving eight. That one long. Point E Town. Brooke Snyder back in. Snyder to serve, nine serving seven. Nelson right at the net. Fortner just gets it over. Davis to Janes outside. Ella Brown, and she gets the kill. Ten serving seven. Hatcher to Vest for Worrell. Back towards the middle. Ella Brown to James for Phil Pot. She tools the block, gets the kill. 11 serving seven, and Central Harden takes their first time out. This is a Harden County Educational Community Television student production. HCC TV is a division of Harden County Schools. Live Channel 1 programming, sponsored in part by Brandenburg. Telecom, Physical Therapy Associates, eTownSelfStorage.com, Waddell's Auto and Scrap Metal Recycling, eTown Exterminating, and West Point Bank. We'd also like to thank all of our student workers tonight. Tayshawn Jackson, Ethan Gross, Jack Settle, Mariah uh, Sullivan, all under the direction of Mr. Jeremy Miller. We are in set number three, eTown took set number one, 26-24. They took set number two, 25 20. Immediately following the game, we will have players named to the all tournament team. Then we will have the district runner up trophy presentation followed by the district championship trophy. Again, both of these teams will make it to next week's region tournament held at Green County. The district winner will play a Another district's runner-up in the first round. Atcher to Vest. Worrell can clear the tape. Brooke Snyder at the line for the Panthers. 12 serving seven. The only way in the region terms, the only way that two teams from the same district can meet will be in the finals. Atcher. To Vest, outside Worrell, off the front line. Smallwood gets that one. Jane's going to bump set outside. Ella Brown, and that one didn't clear the net. Point central. And that'll send Claire Worrell to the line for the Bruins. Eight, serving 12. Smallwood, this will be tight to the net. Pounced over. Philpot sends it up. Janes will tap it over. Diving dig from Nelson right inside. Fortner, she gets the kill off the assist from Vest. 
Nine serving 12. Smallwood to Janes. In the middle, Phil Pot off the front line. Vest to Nelson. Back for Atcher. Off the front line, Davis gets that one to Janes. She'll bump set it on the outside. Ella Brown does a good job to get back over. Blocked inside from Nelson. James with the block. As Macy Singleton checks back in on the front line, Alyssa Philpott heads to the service line. 13 serving nine. And that'll be an ace. 14 serving nine. Nelson to Vest in the middle, Fortner tapped over. Ella Brown to James, back for Singleton. That goes wide, point central. Town Faithful thought that one caught a line. Gracie Blair checks in for Central Harden. She'll head to the service line. 10 serving 14. Davis to James for Ella Brown. Blocked the net. Popped in the air by Atcher to Vest. Back for Atcher. It was over. Snyder gets that one to Jane. Back row, Smallwood dug out by Nelson to Vest. For Atcher, and she gets the kill down the line. Brooke Davis back in on the back line for Elizabeth Town. 11 serving 14. Smallwood to Snyder. Now Smallwood will bump it back line. Nelson to Vest. Outside, Atcher off the front line. Smallwood gets the dig. James will try to dump it over. Atcher sends it back. Snyder to James. Outside, Ella Brown. And that doesn't clear the tape. Point central. 12 serving 14. Davis to James. Singleton will send that one over. Vest gets it to Fortner. That one dug up. That's going to be a lift. Against E-Town Point Central. Timeout. E-Town. Tune in weekly for all local HCC TV programs. Airing on Brandenburg Telecom and Comcast Cable Channel 2. Spectrum Communications Channel 184. You can always check out our past broadcast on our YouTube channel. Just search HCEC TV. Subscribe to our channel and get all your local community sports and events. Again, Friday night, we're back on the air. We'll be at Central Harden as they will host District Foe. Barron County, whoever wins that game, will host a first round playoff matchup a couple of weeks later. Next week, we will. Uh, if either Central Harden or Elizabethtown make it to the semifinals in the fifth region tournament at Greene County, we will be there for that. We'll also be there if either team makes it to the finals. Next Friday night, we will be back at Central Harden as they will host the Bryan Station Defenders. That went at 7.30, and Coach Paul Gray will bring you all of that action. Friday night's kickoff this week is at 8 o'clock start time. Snyder to James, across for Ella Brown, off the front line. Worrell gets that one to Vest for Atcher, and Atcher tools the block. And five straight points by the Bruins. Has tied it up, 14 serving 14. Gracie Blair at the line for the Bruins. 
Davis. And that would be an ace as it gets in the rafters. 15 serving 14. And the Maroons have to have this set in order to continue the match. Into that service error point, Panthers. Grace Godfrey will check back in and head to the service line. 15 serving 15. Blair to Vest. She sends it over. Pick up by Snyder, then Davis now. Smallwood sends it over. Atcher to Vest in the middle for Fortner, and she gets the kill. As Larkin Taylor will check back in on the front line, Sam Nelson heads to the service line. 16 serving 15. Sales long. Kenna Brown back in on the front line for the Panthers. Addison James now to serve. 16 serving 16. Blair to Vest for Atcher off the front line, dug out by Godfrey. Jane sends it across Smallwood. Worrell picks that one up. Vest for Atcher back across. Davis gets that dig. Jane's going to send it out for Smallwood. She'll roll it in there. Atcher to Vest. Back for Atcher. Just goes off speed. With a dink over. Gets the kill. Sadie Etcher now to serve for Central Harden. 17 serving 16. Coach Catlett doing floor work tonight. That would end in that service error. As Alyssa Philpont back in on the front line as Lexi Davis heads to the service line. 17 serving 17. Atcher to Vest. Outside Worrell across. Samoa gets to it. Davis, and they're going to call a double. Point central. Kate Disselkamp back in. As Katie Vess heads to the service line. 18, serving 17. Davis to Jane, the outside Smallwood. She winds up. That one's right down the line. Ella Brown checking the back in on the front line for E-Town as Jessica Smallwood goes to the service line. 18, serving 18. Hatcher to Vest, cross for Worrell, rolls that one, Ella Brown pops it up. Janes for McKenna Brown, back row, it's long, point central. Jordan Fortner back in on the front line, Addison Sego now to serve, 19 serving 18. Smallwood to Janes, right in the middle for Phil Pont, blocked there by Fortner. Nestle can't knock it over, Brown sent it back. Atcher now will send it over. 
James to Davis for Brooke. Or sorry, McKenna Cox. Whew. McKenna Brown, sorry. Claire Worrell gets the kill. I apologize. Twenty serving eighteen. Smallwood to Janes, back for Smallwood. Hatcher to Fortner, now Worrell will cut it across. Davis gets that one to Janes. McKenna Brown just taps it over. Sego gets that one to Vest. Outside, Worrell to the middle. Davis gets it. Janes will play it back row. Now Smallwood will bump it. Hatcher gets that one. It's going to be tight to the net. Vest pops it up. Fortner, Vest sends it back, and that will do it as point will go over to the Panthers. Sam Nelson will check in on the back line for the Bruins as Brooke Snyder heads to the service line for the Panthers. 19 serving 20. Atcher to Vest for Worrell down the line. Snyder gets that one to James outside Ella Brown. That doesn't clear the tape, point central. Claire Worrell now to serve, 21 serving 19. Smallwood to Janes, back for Smallwood. Blocked to the net by Fortner, popped over. Vest outside, Atcher, she'll roll it to the middle and not able to return it, point central. 22 serving 19, and Etown will take their second time out. Tune in weekly for all local HCC TV programs airing on Brandenburg Telecom and Comcast Cable Channel 2, Spectrum Communications Channel 184. You can always check out our past broadcast on our YouTube channel. Just search HCC TV. Subscribe to our channel. Get all your local community sports and events. They get the draw after all of district play is finished. Tournaments are finished within the four districts of our region. They will have a draw at Green County and sign the schedule will come out again we will not carry the opening round but if either elizabeth town or central harden make it to the semifinals or the finals we will have those matches for you here on hcc tv Snyder to Davis, sent back over. They wanted to double on that one. Vest inside Fortner. That one popped up, sent over, but that'll go wide, point central. Twenty-three serving nineteen. Snyder to Janes, outside Ella Brown, blocked the net by Fortner, Davis to Janes, now back row Smallwood, she'll roll it over. Nelson right the net for Vest, net for Vest and Fortner with another kill. And Central now will serve for set number three. Twenty-four serving nineteen. That one sails long. Point E Town. Macy Singleton will check back in on the front line as Alyssa Philpon heads off to the service line. Twenty serving twenty-four.
Worrell to Vest for Fortner. We have a net violation on Central Harden. I believe it was Jordan Fortner that slid under. Point E Town, 21, serving 24. Ace. 22 serving 24. Morell to Vest outside Atcher. That one blocked at the net. Fortner can't get that one over point E town. And Central Harden going to take their last time out in set number two. I'd like to thank Mike McCune, athletic director here, Coach Walter Hampton, the, direct, uh, the volleyball coach here at John Harden, for putting on the 17th district tournament. A lot of things happen behind the scenes to make all of this happen in front. We come back out of the huddles. Alyssa Philpot will be at the line for the Panthers. 23, serving 24. Morell to Vest, outside Atcher. Blocked to the net, Nelson sends it over. Ella Brown to Janes in the middle, Singleton off the front line. Vest gets that one to, ne uh, to Nelson. Backside, Atcher, that's into the net. And we're tied at 24 apiece, five straight points for the Panthers. Nelson to Vest. For Fortner, taps that one over. Snyder to James in the middle. Singleton blocked there. Singleton pops it back up. James right back to Singleton. She gets the kill. And E-Town will serve for the district title. Alyssa Philpott at the line. 25, serving 24. Morell to Vest for Atcher. Off of Phil Pot. Smallwood sends it back in. Now Ella Brown sends it over. Morell to Vest. Cross for Atcher. It's long. And E Town are the 17th district champions. They win it in straight sets. This is a Hardin County Educational and Community Television student production. HCC TV is a division of Hardin County Schools. Live Channel 1 programming sponsored in part by Brandenburg Telecom, Physical Therapy Associates, more personal, or sorry, Physical Therapy Associates, eTownSelfStorage.com, Waddell's Auto and Scrap Metal Recycling, eTown Exterminating, and West Point Bank. Now we're going to have... Athletic Director Mike McCune come in. They will do the all-tournament team. There will be three players selected from Central Harden High School, four players selected from Elizabethtown High School, and they'll have the presentation of the district runner-up trophy and the district champion trophy.
Coach Walter Hampton doing this. Has his grandson in his arms. A few days ago, he, helped, he welcomed in his first granddaughter. Sadie Atcher, Katie Vest, and Sam Nelson named to the all-tournament team for the Bruins. Addison James, Alyssa Philpott, Macy Singleton, and Jessica Smallwood. Now we'll have the presentation of the 17th District Runner-Up Trophy. Seventeenth District Championship Trophy goes to Elizabethtown. And like to thank all of our student workers tonight that made this possible this entire week here. Tayshawn Jackson, Ethan Gross, Jack Settle, Lariah Sullivan, along with Mr. Jeremy Miller. Again, we will see you next week at the Region Tournament in Greene County. For all of us here at HCC TV, I'm Bobby Thompson saying so long and good night.